Shex Mill is located in beautiful Beaver Creek Valley, about five miles outside of my hometown in Caledonia. The mill was built in 1876 by John Blinn. Michael Sheck bought the mill in 1887 and had his sons Fred and Edward up, up operate the mill. Three Leffel turbines and one Samson turbine powered the mill. As you can see here, the water's low. This is where they had walked in and out from their grain into the mill. That's where they brought the, the grain up through the mill. This is the valley that the Beaver Creek runs through to come down to the dam. In 1922, the concrete dam was put in to replace the old wooden one. Two years later, a concrete water wheel pit was also built. The old mill stream is a great place to catch brown and brook trout. I've spent many days here trout fishing with my dad ever since I was little. It's always been a great place for us to get away and fish. This was where the dam was built and the mill was Mill Creek was redirected. Water is directed under that waterway, under this bridge, and into the mill. They have their own pulley system to lift up the wall to let and regulate the water in and out. Shucks Mill was nominated for National Registry of Historic Places in 1977. It was at this time that Shex Mill was the only mill in the state to remain unchanged and have the same working milling equipment and original stone. Shex Mill is one of the only three mills in Minnesota to run solely off water power. On the summer weekends, the mill offers tours and demonstrations of how they grind their wheat into flour, still using all the original equipment. The mill also offers several different handmade items for people. Shex Mill is an important historical site in my home area and has been in the same family for generations.